This is the start and start procedure for your five and a half horse Honda engine. You have your on switch right here. You have your throttle control here. When starting this engine, you want to bring it up to a, about a quarter throttle. Your on switch for your fuel is in the on position right now. You have your choke. Choke this way or choke back off. You may not need the choke if the engine has done been running for a while and if it's warm. At this point, you can full start the engine. Starting your cold water washer, it makes it easier on the machine to start, get the trigger, and squeeze so that it doesn't feel back pressure on the pump. Once you've done this, you can start your engine. After you've started the system, have the water coming out, then you can let the gun off, and you can put your tips in, or put your wands in, and you're ready to wash. This is the starting procedure for your generator to run the lights on your trailer system. Uh, back in the back right here, you do have your choke switch. Right here is the switch that will be turned on in the up position to start the engine, start the generator. At the top where your fuel goes in, you have a priming valve. In order to do this, the valve needs to be turned in the off position. The orange knob will be pulled up and then pump it three times, give or take. This will allow it to get a prime going into the generator to make it start easier. Once you've done the priming, turn the knob to the on position. This will let the system vent. At this point in time, you're ready to start the generator.
turn the generator off. Below the pull rope is the off switch, rotated in the downward position. This will shut the generator off. It is also important that before using the lights on this system, or any other lights, that you make sure that you do have your generator warmed up, giving it plenty of time to be prepared to run your lights.